When the Olympics opening ceremony ends on Friday, the weekend already has got plenty of promise for India because you could potentially be having two medals, both hopefully in shooting. But shooting has its got has got its own problems when you look at it. Not since Abhinav Bindra, not since Gagan Narang, not since Vijay Kumar. India has always flattered to deceive, be it 2016, be it 2021. Now, as far as the weekend is concerned, what are India's medal chances? So, there are hopes of medals in two events, archery and shooting. Why archery suddenly we have gotten a spike in interest? Because the qualifying was done in such a way that they qualified in the top four. The men's and the women's team both had excellent performances. The onus now is on shooting. Whatever you have done in this one year through the ISSF World Cups and all those other things, two of them, if you look at it, especially pistol, you look at air rifle, all of that now comes into fruition now. Archery has done its bit in the first stage. Can shooting follow it also? Because... If you followed the India recurve archery rankings and what happened, the R rankings round in particular, they did well in both the men's and the women's. Both when, if you look at it, Tarundeep Rai, if you look at Dheeraj Bhammadevaraya, Praveen Jadav, all of them, followed by Ankita Pakat, then you got Bhajan Kaur and Deepika Kumari. All of them put in a top four performance. Now, because of that top four performance, what has happened? They avoid, both men and women, avoid South Korea until the final. South Korea are in recurve archery, what China is in table tennis. Absolute beasts in the sport. Potential 2-3 wins away from a historic medal. Because 2-3 wins, why? If you win the quarterfinal, if you win the semifinal, if you win the semifinal, you're assured of a medal. If you lose the semifinal, potentially then you could go into a bronze medal playoff. So that is why it is very, very important that yes, India at least wins the semi-final. So if it's India, they will have to face South Korea only in the final. So the advantage of finishing in the top four has benefited both the men and women. So in the team event, you can actually dream. And if you want to dream further, look at what is going to happen in the 10 meter air rifle mixed team event. Now, why is there a bit of hope when you look at the 10 meter air rifle mixed team event? The last three words that I've said, mixed team event. Team events, when you look at it, especially in the Asian games, in shooting, India did very, very well. And that is why if you look at India face a potential medal event in 10 meter air rifle mixed team event. The team consists of Ramita Jindal, Arjun Babuta, Elanavil Valdarivan and Sandeep Singh. These four guys will ensure that, yes, they would want to do well in 10 meter air rifle. Now, if they go through that, the medal rounds begin from 4 p.m. IST. India's mixed team has done well in previous international events, although not set the stage on fire, but they have done just about enough. Even in the trials that happened prior to the Olympics, they ensured that they got it. And that is why perhaps, perhaps a chance India can win their first medal tomorrow. What color? We don't know at this point. There is also another potential event that is there on Sunday, which is the 10 meter air pistol men's event. Now, 10 meter air rifle event is done. Now it is time for the 10 meter air pistol event. That too with the men's. Now, Sarabjot Singh will be in contention if he reaches the final. And Sarabjot Singh, all hopes are placed on this youngster because Sarabjot managed to win the gold medal in the ISSF World Cup that was held in Bhopal in the 10 meter air pistol event. So that is why this is going to be very, very important. Sarabjot Singh in the pistol event will be very important at this point and the final will start from 1 p.m. IST onwards. Tomorrow is the qualification, Sunday will be the final. So that is why 28th is going to be very, very important. So 27th and 28th in shooting, you might see something special for India. But as we have all known, 2021 is a cautionary tale. Saurabh Chaudhary was absolutely nailing it in the qualifiers, but in the main final, he froze. And that is why he couldn't get the medal. One hopes that the likes of Saurabh uh, and all the others, they do not mess up at this point in time in Paris. 
Thank you so much folks for joining us for this video. Subscribe to Sports Today for all the latest news and analysis.